Welcome to Finland, welcome to Pietrasari, where Nautosuon is building boats from 1966. I am Giovanni Pomati, uh, I'm Italian, I'm working uh, uh, between Italy and Finland and uh, uh, I joined Nautosuon as group CEO in uh, uh, 2018. We are here in uh, the Boat Building uh, Technology Center. This is what we call shortly DTC. That's uh, the new plant of Nautor Swan that uh, some years ago decided uh, to unify under this uh, roof uh, and near to the sea all different departments uh, that make the production uh, of our boats. My colleagues uh, will lead you around the factory. There you, you will also see on top of uh, technologies, uh, the, the boat that we are building in different stages of production. We have been uh, never as full uh, uh, of boats as we are at the moment. Uh, we have uh, uh, around 20 boats in production. My name is Marco Rentaniemi and now I'm presenting the uh, milling machine that is a five axis robot that we use for all types of milling and mold making here at Nautor. We're able to make over 30 meter long molds. Uh, the width is six meters and the height is three meters. So we have a very versatile tool that we can use for all type of mold manufacturing. The robot is also used for, for many other things than mold manufacturing. Uh, we, we make plants to, to, as inserts to our molds. We also use, use it to mill out core for structures. So it's, it's a very versatile piece of equipment that we use for many things here at Nautos. Hello and welcome to Hall D. My name is Bill Natalie and I'm the manager for the structural parts of Nautus One. Here in this building, we primarily build the structural elements, the, the main bulkheads, the longitudinal girders for the maxi range, as well as some lightweight options for the smaller yachts in the range. The materials here need to be handled very carefully as they, the resin is injected in the factory, delivered here by freezer truck in order to get the optimal carbon to resin ratio. It is then put into our freezers on site and only comes out into production when it's, when it's needed. In this facility we have developed a system called S-Sync where I can't say too much about it but it revolves around the various materials being cut in their pre-cured state by machine which allowed us to build a very high quality accurate part which would not be out of place in a high-end racing yacht. This is something we're very proud of. Ovens we have here, we have five ovens in this facility, two of which have 60 square meter vacuum tables, and this is where the big maxi bulkheads and longitudinals are made. And then we have a vertical cure oven. This is necessary for the mast bulkheads, where we have very many extras on each side and if, of laminate, and if we didn't have it hanging, there's a danger it could be out of balance. Then there's the small parts oven, which runs every night, curing the multitude of parts necessary to go into a swan yacht. I'm Joachim Mas. I'm the painting supervisor and now we are standing in the showroom where we have windows so we can easily follow when a boat is being spray painted. Some of the key factors to perform a good uh, spray job is to be able to control or to have a good airflow, to control the temperature, humidity and also to have strong lights. Uh, here behind me we have the brand new spray boot. Uh, high-technology spray boot, which is driven by natural gas. 
Post curing can also be controlled and we can raise the temperatures up to 80 degrees. Uh, during the spraying mode, we have approximately 440,000 cubic meters of air every hour. We are able to digitally adjust and control the temperature, humidity, and we have over 400 LED lights, so we have a really bright area to perform the paint jobs in. My name is Anders Keitur and I work here as a joinery manager. A few years ago we moved from the old facility in Kronoby to this new facility here in Jakobstad. We have completely renewed these facilities with a new spraying boot, with a drying oven, also we have CNC milling machine and also sanding machines. Uh, also we have installed a humidity system to ensure that we have the same humidity in the facility during the whole year. This is really important, uh, uh, at least in the winter time, when we have a really dry air here in Finland. To ensure that we get the high quality veneer for all the projects, we always visit our uh, veneer suppliers and select the veneer for each project. Uh, when the veneer is here, we do another selection so we uh, can ensure that we have the right color and grain for each boat. Uh, we also have much better control of the quality when we work like this. Sometimes we also build bigger mock-ups for the clients. For the smaller boats, we often do, do smaller samples to show the client so the client can see how it really will look when the boat is ready. My name is Mikael Sundqvist. I'm the assembly manager of production. And we are now standing in the new assembly hall. It's uh, 4,000 square meters and about 130 meters long. Uh, we have now 14 boat slots. It's the 48 line, 54, 65, 78 and 98. We start from an empty hull and uh, install all the mechanical, plumbing and electrical. We also install all the furniture that is made in the joinery. Also deck and keel, the final product ready to be tested. I hope uh, uh, now I think that the Atua tour is over. I hope that you enjoyed uh, uh, this uh, visit uh, and I hope uh, very, very soon uh, uh, to get back to normality and uh, to have uh, you guys physically here staying with us uh, and experience uh, uh, then uh, a, a real tour of uh, uh, our factory.